Good evening, everyone, and welcome to another video on the Freedom Seekers channel. The topic of today's video is one click Amazon product research. Finding a product to sell on Amazon has never been this easy. But first, don't forget to smash that like button down below and subscribe to this channel to be up to date with all my videos and to be in the know for all things Amazon FBA. Let's get right to it. So product research is arguably the most important phase in your Amazon FBA journey. Because if you don't find a good product, it doesn't matter how good of a launch plan you have, doesn't matter how good you are at PPC or at optimizing your listing. If your product is bad from the beginning, you are going to have a very hard time being successful in selling that product. But a lot of people also have a very difficult time when they're doing product research. Some people might, might take them hours, some might take days, some might take weeks, months, or some might never ever source um, or find their first profitable product. But thankfully, there are tools and there are software out there that makes this task, this very tedious task, as easy as it gets. And nobody does it better currently than Viral Launch. They have their product discovery tool and very recently, maybe about three weeks ago, as of this recording, they released a very, very awesome feature um, as part of their product discovery suite. And as I mentioned in my introduction, it's literally one click and it gives you results that you can take action on. It gives you results that, um, that really vastly increases your chances of finding that profitable product. And when I say one click, I literally mean one click. Um, they have different types of searches that you can run. So um, in this first example, I went to keyword and from this drop down, they have a list of five different presets. And all I did was to click on one of them low barrier to entry for example and it just sped out all these results I didn't have to tinker with any of the filters or do make any changes all I did was to click that one button now um, behind the scenes they have configured these presets in some ways to kind of match what um, what the the actual preset is all about so for example, um, low barrier to entry means that um, the number of reviews will be fairly low or at least not very high. So maybe 250 or less. Um, the, the costs of the product might be on the lower end, maybe in some instances. And um, there are some other metrics that they take into consideration, but let's look at some of these results. Um, so this one, um, actually, so another thing I should point out is, um, they have this tag, um, that says warning popular result. And this is where, um, viral launch is kind of telling us that this particular result is a popular one because a lot of their users are finding this result and are probably pinning it or, or looking more in details at this result. So just a word of caution that if you want to source this product, uh, just just be reminded or just know that there are maybe a ton of other people who are looking into sourcing this product as well. Not that that is a barrier to, to entry or sourcing that product, but it's just one thing to take into consideration. Um, let's see if we can find a good one to drill down into. Um, 
Okay, so maybe let's look at this 10 by 10 letter board. I've seen it a couple of times in this list. Um, so sales pattern is typical. So you don't have to worry about it being seasonal or being popular one time of the year versus another time. If you source this product, chances are you'll be able to sell it year round. Uh, size tier for this is large. Uh, now a lot of people tell you when you're going into FBA, you you do the standard um, must fit in a shoe box, must weigh less than two pounds. Now that's um, that's kind of archaic these days because if you think outside of the box and if you go against the status quo, chances are you will have a better chance of finding successful products, and you don't have to be competing with a ton of other people. So even if the even though it says that the size for this product is large you can definitely go into it and be successful um, the price change is a good indicator that um, the price for this product has some sort of stability so it's not like um, the the price for it is just dropping and if you get in now um, you're not going to be able to make any decent margin so a minus 4% price change, I think it might be over a year or over a month, I'm not sure. But you can look at this indicator to, to note uh, the sp uh, price stability. Um, review change, uh, review rate. Um, so another cool thing that you can do is you can pull up market intelligence um, actually you can pin this if you want to go back to it later or you can view the product on Amazon but while this is running let's check out this listing on Amazon Um, so those are loading let's check out another preset um, quick wins so um, so for the low bar to entry preset um, one of the key things I think, one of the key metrics that it, it or filters that it, it has behind the scenes is the review count. So as we can see here, most of the, the products on this first page have very low review counts, which is a really good thing. Um, I think 320 is the most, but a lot of these sellers in the top 10 have less than 75 reviews. So that just shows you um, that it might not be too difficult to compete in this market. Um, let's see what market intelligence tells us. Detail stats for the top 10 listings. The average review count is 38.9. Um, average revenue is a bit on the low side, but again, the barrier to entry is very low. So if we can source um, this product for a decent price um, and you make almost four thousand dollars per month if you have a margins of let's say close to 50 percent you're looking at two thousand dollars a month in profit so that's why it's called low barrier to entry right because it doesn't take much to to compete and to rank on page one with very low reviews uh, so let's quickly look at um, quick wins. See if we can find another um, good product. Okay, one gallon water bottle margin sixty two percent. Let's see, review change. Oh, average review is 112. Um, okay, this looks interesting. So let's look at 
we're going to Amazon for this one. And also, let's pull up um, market intelligence for this item. that one so there is probably um this is more like a I don't know any glue but uh, most of these have low review counts which is good Okay, so with the click of a button and on the very first page of the search results, we found a product that according to Viral Launch looks like a home run, right? Possible monthly sales 200 to 2500, reviews needed to sell well 20 to 100. So it's not too difficult to compete in this market sales pattern typical meaning that you can sell this all year long um but let's dig deeper into um the results on page one all right um I, I like to look at the detailed stats because it gives a, a really a snapshot of everything that's going on on page one so for example if you get to top five you, if you rank in the top five you are looking at a thousand eleven hundred sales per month average revenue almost twenty thousand dollars and average price sixteen thousand um average review count for the top five sellers is 180 so a little steep but um let me show you something um even though it says 188 we have this person number four he has 10 10 reviews and is selling over nearly eight thousand dollars per month um, now number two has 23 reviews and they're doing nearly fifteen thousand um, now Vera launch and at least market intelligence again they provide a wealth of data that you can use to make very informed decisions now I looked at this is number two, the number two ranked seller for this product, one gallon water bottle. And they started selling in October. So we can track their BSR to see how well they have been doing. Um, in November, steady 40,000. So they, they, they launched in October and have been kind of steady, maybe getting a few sales here and there each day. But then we see after December, when everybody have gotten or getting into the fitness um, fitness crave and those New Year's resolution to be fit, maybe this is a product that a lot of um, people who exercise a lot use. You can see his sales really picked up uh, or kicked off because his BSR dropped to way less than ten thousand, and he's been at. 5,000 or around 5,000 since January so for for a seller for a pro seller who launched this product only three or four months ago to be number two with 23 reviews and is doing nearly a thousand units per month again I didn't have to do anything but click on one button to find this product which looks very very promising and if I didn't create this video I might have launched this product myself because the numbers look really really good um, their cost estimator says that you can source this product for less than four dollars Amazon's fees less than five dollars and your profit per unit about five dollars um, the profit is a little bit on the low side but if you're doing 800 sales per month that's a four thousand dollar profit at five dollars per unit this is the power 
of viral launch and if you ever had an excuse into what is preventing you from getting into Amazon FBA um, and if your excuse was that oh I can't find a product product research is just so hard then you have no excuses because I've just shown you here how viral launch with your product discovery tool has made it a no-brainer to find products to sell on Amazon now I'm just gonna cut this video a little short because I don't want to um, go over too much but there's just so much um, so much that I want to show show you and to share with you but um, this is kind of how I do my product research these days um, oh one last thing before I go let me just pull up merchant words Oh, merchant word uh, uh, no that's not what I want I want to pull up merchant word yes it is merchant words not merchant word sorry um, and the last thing I want to do is to validate the search volume for this product um, So one gallon water bottle. And let's see how much um, search we're getting um, for this product. And voila, 78,000 monthly searches for one gallon water bottle. Now the numbers they just line up perfectly this this product is ripe to get into the search volume is there the review count is favorable you don't need a lot of reviews to compete um, the margins are there um, the the sales volume and velocity is there so the only question is are you there and I'll just end with that so once again, um, one click Amazon FBA product research is here and you really have no excuse not to source and find your next profitable product to launch on Amazon. Now I hope you found a ton of value out of this video. And again, if you have any questions, um, we have a Facebook, Facebook group that's growing. Um, but you can also feel free to comment, leave comments below in the comment section if you have any questions whatsoever. And I will be very, very prompt in responding to those comments or questions. Um, but also turn on notifications so that you get notified as soon as I release new videos. And I hope to see you in the next video. Thanks.